I'll tell you what, Batum, another defensive gym. Yeah, I think that was maybe Terrence Mann. Nice pass oh, on the oh inside. My. Wow, Batum with the flush, but how about the pass? Watch Rondo looking it over off the dribble. Lead him, finish it for Batum. That's just good basketball. First four of seven from above the arc for this first quarter. Paul George has three of those. Not this time. Batum blocks it again. Well, Nicholas Batum has just been so phenomenal the last couple of times out. McDermott for three. Another block by Batum. And he's really come alive again. But some of these players for the Clippers. Another live ball turnover. Here comes Batum with the flush. And the Clippers have tied it up at 49-40 to play in the first half. If hands can come up with deflections, that one there, anticipating the pass back out. Batum gets the deflection. 5 of 11 from above the arc. McDermott to Batazzi. Blocked again by Batum, his third. Pacers unable to convert on the second effort. About the number of shots that Batum blocks. Well, that one he comes in. It's a little more familiar with the system, and they're a little more familiar with him. Batum is left alone in the corner. That provokes a three. Trey Bien, Nicholas Batum. McConnell comes away with another clever defensive play. Oh, Batum has blocked it again. Paul George chases down his fifth rebound. He has five assists, also 34 points. From the same spot, he opened up the quarter with, knocks it down. Clippers by nine. It's because of his size, Paul George over the defense. That's Rondo, got a piece of that, causes the deflection. Power play for the Clippers. Man misses. Batum cleans it up 113 to 101. George dumps it to Patterson, touch pass to Batum. Oh, it's Park Place for Batum. He has 12 points. Because he's so long and athletic and quick that he winds up reaching around you, taking the ball. Batum waltzes to the cup and lays it in.